India houses many TB patients. One Indian dies of this disease every minute. Dr. Zareer Udwadia was the one who diagnosed first totally drug resistant TB patient in India. He says there are only 12 drugs available in India for TB and there are many patients who are resistant to one or the other drug. And the shocking news is there are patients who are resistant to all these 12 drugs. He was the one who gave an alarming note to the Indian government on identifying these types of TBs and also take actions in finding drugs for it and stop spreading it. His research eventually led to improvements in the way TB is managed in India. It forced the government to make changes to the TB control initiatives. Recently, Indian government had rejected the application of Johnson & Johnson on extending its patent over the drug Benoculin, which is a major relief for many patients today. This is one of the drugs which is not available to more than 60,000 TB patients who are drug resistant. TB itself is a very deadly disease which have killed thousands and millions of patients over the last 200 years and main thing is it is an airborne disease. Still, India is fighting so hard to become a TB free nation over the last years. Dr. Zareed Udwadia is an Indian pulmonologist and researcher. His work on drug-resistant TB has led to improvements in India's national TB control program. Dr. Udwadia was the only Indian invited by the World Health Organization to be part of the TB guidelines group. He was also the only doctor to be named among India's best strategists. Udvadia's research drew the attention of the medical community to the growing epidemic of drug-resistant TB. Even the coordinator of the World Health Organization's Stop TB Department called his findings a wake-up call. His mission is to educate the masses about the difficulties and complexities of the treatment of drug-resistant TB. His publication of the first Indian patient with Totally drug-resistant TB featured in many leading journals and mass media galvanized great change in the community. He continues to be a vocal advocate for newer diagnosis and treatment of TB patients. Be the change wherever you are.